Supporters and opponents of Syrian President Bashar al-Assad gathered outside the Syrian embassy in Cairo on Sunday amid escalating violence in the country where the death toll has reached 3,000 people since the start of the uprising in March. Sunday also saw the Arab League issued its strongest condemnation of the violence in Syria, but it stopped short after suspending the country from the organization. Syria officials were to hold more talks in Qatar with delegates of the Arab League and to establish dialogue with the opposition in Cairo. Although the League has given Assad two weeks to hold the dialogue, the president shows no signs of easing the crackdown. The demonstration in Cairo attracts both Assad's opponent and his supporters. Today, the regime has sent, at the expense of the Syrian people, thugs and paid people to stand and cheer for them. The people standing here and chanting, the people want the execution of Bashar as the true Arab Syrians. They reflect the true voices of the streets in Syria. Nobody has paid them. They have sacrificed everything to speak out. However, the others have been paid to come here and mimic Assad's words. The president's supporters blame Syria living in exile for destabilizing Syria. In a related news, Syrian activists have appealed to the international community to impose no fly zone on Syria and to protect civilians from brutal crackdown. Ikram Yaqub, Al-Arabi.